What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the Binding of Isaac. Anti-birth. That is anti-birth. Oh, let's get, a, let's get an Eden run in here. Why not? You know, why not? Let's try to have some better luck against the Witness. And we're starting really strong here, actually. D does this game have extra HUD? I think it does. Does it? Nah. It doesn't. Okay. Okay. That's fine. Um, but yeah, Guppy's Head and uh, Toxic Aura, which I love Toxic Aura. We just got to... We gotta forget about that last loss, and I apologize. This night might not be updating uh, the next day. I might have missed a day, and that day would probably be Saturday, I'm assuming, if uh, my calculations are correct. But yes, I've been having some upload issues, some recording issues, but uh, it should all be straightened out now. The new ISP has just been a little bit confusing. We got Juicy Sack. It's been a little bit confusing because, uh, well, one, I accidentally recorded the last episode at 50,000 bitrate. And for people that know uh, a thing or two about bitrate, you can tell right off the bat that is stupid. There's no reason to record Isaac at 50,000 bitrate because it probably won't make a quality difference. But it makes your file size uh, four or five times bigger. Um, so, yeah, I'm back down to 15,000 bitrate, which is still more than enough for Isaac. Bit bitrate, basically, in lamest, lamest terms, uh, layman's terms, not lamest terms, um, it basically just, how, if there's a lot of movement on the screen, so say like a first-person shooter, your bitrate needs to be high, uh, because if not, the pixels won't be able to catch up. Uh, but for a game like Isaac, where most of the pixels on the screen are actually static, as you can see, everything on the screen right now is static except me, my tears, and the enemy. It's kind of crazy. Like, the walls don't move, nothing really goes on, so... Bitrate's not that important. So basically, on, uh, just to get cut to the chase, the last episode I uploaded, yes, it was only 720p, but it was 50,000 bitrate, so it took me about five hours to upload it so that kind of effed up my whole schedule um so i apologize for that so if this is a day late that's on me and uh we're doing anti-birth again today but that doesn't mean we're going to be doing anti-birth forever uh people seem to like it it was nice to be able to like kind of get your guys reaction reactions for it and uh yeah go from there curse room wasn't super worth it but we did get a range up i believe which isn't Anything to sneeze at considering Toxic Aura. Did we get a range up? I think we did. Toxic Aura does have a shorter range inherently. Um, I mean, we just go down, right? I mean, why not take advantage of the early double item room right off the get, right? Let's do it. And this is in 1080p. So I, I'm kind of getting back on, on track here. Uh, just a little bit of a hiccup because we've been changing computer setups, changing ISPs, been all over the place, so... I think we should all be good now. We're at 1080p. We're at 15,000 bitrate. The upload shouldn't take a day and a half. But like I said, we're not going to do anti-birth forever. We'll probably, you know, sprinkle it in here and there. Um, I do want some revenge. I'm not going to lie. I want some revenge on our boy, The Witness, because we failed. We failed hard, man. Uh, I, I watched that fight back, and I just, I was on my heels the whole entire time. I couldn't get my footing. And he killed me before I even knew what was going on. I mean, one of the big things was we weren't at a half-heart interval, so we weren't getting the Polaroid active. Oh, that's a shame. Uh, you know what? I'm, uh, well, we do need bombs for the mines, but not until the next floor. It's okay. Are these red poops? Is red poops even in, in anti-birth? I think they're just tinted red. Yeah, I think we're okay, even if we run into them. But I do love Toxic Aura, and I, I, I mean, Toxic Aura, yeah, dead, uh, you know, Toxic Aura tears, you know what I'm talking about. But I do love this item, I really do. It's one of my favorite tier uh, things, even though it does kill your shot speed and kill your range a little bit. I really love the penetrative effect, and I love that it raises your tier height so you can shoot over rocks. It's really cool. All right, got a bomb back, got a coin, got a couple of soul hearts. That was actually a really nice... Really nice room there. Uh, I mean, I'm going to take the HP up just because... Lockdown, rip. 
<clears throat> just because I don't really care about the book, considering bookworm isn't a thing. Uh, so I don't care about the book. I'm not going to hold on to it over Guppy's head. Taking a lot of damage here. Let's not. Let's not and say we did. How about that? That was the biggest roast when you were a kid. When your friend came over, he's like, hey, oh, hey, Jimmy, why don't we go, uh, why don't we go play uh, some basketball in, in my yard? And you're like, let's not and say we did. Biggest roast. Biggest roast as a kid. Okay, little, uh, leeches over here. They do go over the void. So, oh, we gotta be careful. I mean, that was a really well-placed bomb, but I did take damage, so. Dude. I thought they were done. I thought they were done. I should have known the door didn't open. Damn, dude. This is a... This room is no joke. That guy's gonna explode? Oof. Okay. I, and I'm also very happy to see that some people didn't even know about anti-birth. And uh, I introduced it to them with that last episode. That, that made me really happy to see because... People should know about Anti-Birth, really. Like, if you're an Isaac fan, uh, you should definitely know about Anti-Birth. I, I want to use a bomb to get Nun's Habit, but I'm a little nervous that we won't have two bombs ready for the mines, you know? So, let's just not and say we did. How about we don't and say we did? Oh, poor Jimmy. Wait, am I Jimmy? I think I was Jimmy in the, in the made-up story. I lost it. I lost it. All right. Uh, damage up. Range up. Both pretty damn good. Um, We'll take Demon Baby. You know, not my favorite, but not a bad familiar by any stretch. We got to get another bomb. And we also got to get the key. We got to get the key. It's downpour too. We got to know better. We did pretty well last round uh, with the key and stuff. That's something that can sometimes flee my mind uh so i was happy about that i was happy we got to the witness on the first run back of anti-birth like i said probably a nauseating amount of times in the last episode anti-birth is in my opinion no question harder than afterbirth even afterbirth plus i think it's just harder in general i think the floors are harder the enemies are harder the witness is definitely harder than isaac or blue baby no question about it uh, we'll take Maggie's Faith. We'll also check out the arcade. Sometimes there's this, a uh, soul heart just sitting around, but not this time, unfortunately. We look very ghostly, don't we? Is it is it the lighting on, on Downpour? Is it always like this? Oh, I tried to bait him in. Ah, we still kind of did. Nice, that worked out. That worked out. I mean, we have a good run right now. Like, early on, you know, the Toxic Aura and then some damage up. And Penetrative Tears and the fact that we could shoot over rocks. Like, it's a good start. It's a really good Eden start. And our health wasn't so obnoxiously low that it was, like, you know, detrimental to our start. And uh, Guppy's Head is one of the best space programs in the game, IMHO. I mean, on a room-to-room -room clearing basis, I think it's one of the best. Uh, if we're talking about killing bosses, it's definitely not one of the best, you know, it's it helps you out It softens them up a little bit. There's no question No question here. That is gonna be a death touch pickup for me No doubt about it. I'm gonna do this just to get a little better chance to deal with the devil uh, Wow, I forgot about the old death touch art. It's amazing uh, This is the old art from rebirth. You guys might be saying what the f is that? This was the art that they had for death touch and rebirth and I like it a lot um it just looks badass, in my opinion. It looks really bad. Look at that. It looks like a damn saw blade. I think I know why they changed it. Does it? I think it might resemble a swastika, which, you know, that's not cool. I, I'm not like, I don't think I, I don't like it, you know, because it resembles that, but I don't look at it like that. I look at it like a badass saw blade, especially when it's red and, and like, I don't know. We got, we got toxic aura tears, so. You know, the tiers are bigger than they normally would be. It just looks really cool right now. Okay, we got a haunt fight here. We got to go get the key. Let's not leave before we get the key. AKA the knife. AKA the knife that you use as the key. I'm sorry. What happened to our damage? Doesn't it feel like our damage isn't that high? 
You okay, Death Touch? We're all right. <sighs> so we whiffed on the deal with the devil, which is a bit of a shame, but an HP up is an HP up. We'll do this. We'll, again, go get the key, which probably is in this last room here that we didn't explore. That was close. Nope, not in here. Hate those guys. But with these huge-ass tears, it shouldn't be that big of an issue. All right, we got the knife piece one. Okay, almost did it again. Head on a swivel, Jay. Head on a freaking swivel. All right, let's go to the mines. Two coins before we leave. Any tinted rocks? Nope, doesn't look like it. So the mines, the next the next thing is we need to make sure that we have two soul hearts to get to the mausoleum. <laughs> mausoleum, monastery? I, I lost it already. Oh, that's bullshit. I gotta be more careful about that, though. Oh, that got me? Come on. I should have just shot them straight up because I could shoot over rocks. Those guys shoot so fast. I'm happy I killed them that early. Okay, my reflection would not be good for us right now. Our range is so bad that our tears probably wouldn't get very far. Our range and shot speed is so bad. Uh, so I'm very happy with my decision to refrain from my reflection. And we took the quarter, which isn't like the most exciting item of all time, but... I'm sorry, can I not kill this guy? Yeah, it's not the most exciting item of all time, but you know, it's gonna make the shops a little bit more viable. I mean, we should check for at least a secret room. I think there a bomb exploded down there. I think there, if there was one, we would have found it. This music's so good. Other than the high frequency thing. Yep, knew he was gonna explode. Had to get out of dodge. We just keep moving and firing. We're going to be in a good spot, man. I mean, we're not looking amazing on HP, but we did just get an HP up and we have Maggie's Faith, which is both good. I would like a Tinted Rock. I think it, somebody answered and said, the reason you think there's so many Tinted Rocks is the sheer amount of rocks, the sheer amount of rocks in the mines. And yeah, that's a good point. That's a good point. both X's. That was, that was not good. I gotta stop taking damage. I, I literally need, I need soul hearts to continue. So let's stop being an ass. Okay. Well, steam sale is gonna get bought and then we can buy this and then we can blow this guy up. Better chance at a deal with the devil. Um, I'll just take it now. I mean, it's probably smart to leave it on the ground and then come back for it later, but we don't need the soul hearts after this floor. We need the soul hearts after next floor. Speaking of next floor, we got to remember to get the knife piece. Kind of just self reminder sometimes when I'm doing a little bit of commentary. I'm just, you know, trying to drill it in my own head that I, I, I'm going to need a knife piece on the next floor. Ooh, the Fallen. That's going to be a deal with the Devil item, which is awesome. It's actually pretty simple. I think that drains Red Hearts for a damage boost. If I'm not mistaken. So I can't... Tr let me. I have to like go over this every single time. I can't get the 1 and then the 2. That will bring me to 0 health. This is on the old system where you can't trick the deal with the Devil. However... I will take flight, okay? I will take flight, and we will take this. I hope this doesn't kill me. I'm assuming I'm gonna get a red heart from the eternal heart, and that is gonna drain the red heart. It's also gonna take away my eternal heart. Wait, it didn't? What? But we get a little bit of a damage boost, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, from Bleed Me Dry. The only thing is we really need soul hearts. Like, really badly. There's some nice, nifty dodge in there. Thank God for the tier height. That was nice. Tinted rock in here? No? Oh, shit. Birthright. 
Well, we got Flight and Spectral Tears. Uh, both not amazing, considering we already had uh, a tier height enough to go over most things. Oh, God. I'm confused. All of my controls are backwards. All my controls are backwards. We're fine now. Okay. Yeah, those guys shoot little uh, mind control things, and it basically mirrors your controls. So right is left, and left is right, and it's just very confusing. Got to look for tin and rocks. We need more soul hearts. We're going to put ourselves in a very precarious situation. Don't talk to me or my son ever again. Don't talk to me or my son ever again. Please do not talk to me or my son ever again. It's fine. We're fine. It's fine. It's good. This doesn't mean Dark Bum isn't a piece of shit. All right? Let's just let's get it out there. Let's get it out there in the open. I'm on a mission, dude. All right? I'm on a mission, and that mission is kill the fucking witness because he made me look like a fool last episode. All right? If this piece of shit can do anything to help, just don't talk to me or my son ever again. And my son is not Dark Bum. My son is Demon Baby. I would never be able to reproduce such a piece of garbage. Um, all right. Item room shop done. We probably should continue to look not only for seeker rooms, but uh, for... Can't be up there. But for, you know, Tinder Rocks and Soul Hearts. Sometimes, like, the, it's so dark, man. I don't even know what's happening. Okay. Um, I forgot about this song. It's so good. We'll donate as much as we can, I guess. Um, there is a shop in the, in the monastery mausoleum, but it's okay. We could get more money back. I want to give back to my donation machine a little bit. We have been pretty rude to it. The opportunity presented itself. What's up, soy milk guys? Soy milk friends. Thought that guy would have been dead. I don't know what this is. Oh, exploded firecracker. I don't think I like that. Anything that explodes, that's a trinket. That you don't really know when it's gonna go off. I'm good. That's gonna be a hit. Oh, thank God for flight and spectral tears. Okay, sacrifice room. There's a seeker room. Seeker room, worth it in anti birth. Anti birth, there's an item called the sausage, and it's an all stats up, and you find it. Oh, God. This is a horrendous room. There it is. Trapdoor. Yeah, you find it in secret rooms only, so it's really nice. I'm going to take the speed up over Maggie's Faith. I think it's nice that it gives me the eternal hearts, but I'm a little confused why Bleed Me Dry doesn't get rid of it. Okay, we got a speed up there. Two soul hearts, which is really good. That Pandora's box play was actually nice for us. Man, it seems like my damage should be more, doesn't it? My damage is literally a 5.24, which is not that impressive at all. It looks, our, our tears look very impressive, but they're just a little bit mediocre, to be honest. Which is really weird, considering how badass they look. But looks can be deceiving, man. I'll stick with the uh, speed up. Um, do, yeah, no, I like having almost max speed. It's gonna help us out dodging later on. Super secret room? Could be a lot of spots here. Could it be attached to the knife room? I don't know. 
this mother effer. It just feels like my tears are just like not holding any weight. It's super weird. Oh God, that was close. He <laughs> spawned him right on the spikes, rip. I mean, it's good for instances like that because they're penetrative and have a huge hitbox. But if we're talking inherent straight up damage to this guy, it's just mediocre. He's also going to do the brimstone thing, which we got to be careful about. Yeah, there was, uh, he closed the gap there. We couldn't really do much about it. Damn, dude. It's hard to read those. I struggled with that even when I was playing uh, anti-birth a lot. I mean, a range up? We don't need it at all. We got birthright with Eden, which basically gives us spirit of the night. But it's nice to be able to give uh, those two black hearts or, you know, we got two soul hearts in the deal with the devil that basically paid for this doorway, which is nice. Even like even with that damage bonus, is that a damage bonus? I think it is. It's still like really underwhelming. It's kind of making me nervous if I'm being real. Why'd I take the red heart? Just give it to the piece of garbage floating around. They just all lined up. Pretty sure these guys spawn those guys, so might as well kill them first. Okay. There's got to be a tin rock in here. No? Really? You're so slow, man. My god, dude. Dark bone, please. Oh, yeah. That's the drop we need. This curse of the darkness is so real. And these Bob Marley mother effers. He's going to explode. There he goes. Challenge room, one iron chest. I'm good. I'm good on that. I really am not feeling too confident right now. If I'm being a hundred with you guys. Did we get the... Yeah, we did. We got the other key piece. Freaked out a bit there, but we're good. Bunch of Bob Marley idiots. Like, it will... If we don't get any damage upgrades or tier upgrades, it will take us forever. Like, it will take us forever to kill the witness. Okay, um, I don't know what just dropped there. We are gonna go with uh, Tough Love, even though we don't have an amazing luck stat. Oh, I forget what this does. Pull it. Oh yeah, it's a temporary, it, the damage up runs out. It's kind of weird. I don't really know. I, I guess it would make sense if like we were about to fight a boss or something. I mean, it's nice to be able to room clear with 20 damage or 17 damage, but you can see it already. It's going away. I mean, I wish our damage was like even half this, dude. No sips of the old iced coffee today. Doing an episode a little late here, actually. Later than I, way later than I normally do them. Schedule's all whacked out right now. That's actually really good. Two tears up pills. It's mausoleum one. We could definitely fight the boss here while we have this little bit of a damage upgrade. This guy's no joke, as you can see. Jesus. I don't know about these balls, dude. All right, well, we got hit twice. Another 
range up. Seriously? Did we get to deal with the devil? No. That range up hurts so bad, man. That's really not good. We can check out this uh, item. Oops, saw that. Small rock, come on, small rock. That's a lot of goods. That's a lot of goods. <laughs> So we already found our shop, so this must be like a library of some sort. Indeed it is. I mean, we could pick up Satanic Bible and use it. Let's see what this is. Temporary tears up. We might take it, actually. Yeah, I think we're going to take it. I think we need it, man. I think we need help on the witness fight. If we don't get anything else... I mean, Guppy's head is... Like I said, one of the best items in the game for room-to-room -room clearing, but... Room-to-room -room clearing, it gets less and less important the more you go. I was gonna say Guppy? The Guppy Dream? I fell off the thumbstick. Okay, we gotta remember he doesn't do the diagonal one. That's a real shame. Uh, I'm not going to be able to take that. Tears up, baby. Now our temporary tears up doesn't seem that interesting. Unfortunately. Okay, luck down. Don't want the luck down. We can do this in good conscience. Conscience? Conscious. I'm unconscious, dude. Okay, we got robes. Robes, fine. Totally fine. Just avoid the fear, guys. Obviously, our damage is now, you know, conceded all the way back to its base damage. That seven cent item or shop item item has worn off totally, which is fine. Small rock, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Dark bum, you can't get that red heart, dude. All right, that's mine. Get out of my face. Why am I not using the temporary tears up? Well, because it doesn't do anything. Because we're at the freaking tier cap. God oh, damn. Emperor's good, though. I forget if the Emperor on the Corpse 2... Does the Emperor on the Corpse 2 bring you to the fight or to the chess room? We could always use it on the Corpse 1, which we probably will do, actually. And this money is a little silly at this point. We just need the third key piece, and then we need to find the mom fight. Again, our damage still not great. Not great. Give me that red heart. Need the key, which is right here. All right, might as well do it. No time like the present, right? I don't think we need anything else. I mean, this does nothing for us at all, which is a real shame. I like this mom fight a lot more. I mean, obviously it's more challenging, but it is way more fun. I don't know how she hasn't stomped that bomb rock yet, but. All right, uh, we'll take this. We'll go in here. Oh yeah, it's the Krampus fight. Go in here. Fight the It Lives with this trash ass damage. We're gonna take a lot of damage here, I think. Like, how do you even begin to dodge something like that? No. God damn. God damn. We've done it. We've done it. All right. 
Let's do it. I guess I can, like I said, I can Emperor right off the bat here. Might be our best case scenario. Okay. Well, it's not the multifaceted boss, but it's this boss is no joke, as you can see. Bruh. What is this? 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 I've never seen this phase. We just dodged all of them. We're legends. We're legends. Um, I guess there's no point to not take it. Happy we did. Very happy we did. Could take all of these. Okay, that, that's, that's a big help. That was a big help. Happy about Rotten Baby, happy about the pact. That's good, man, that's good. Uh, I don't know if it's good enough just yet, but it's good. And the fact of the matter is we have no more red hearts, so we don't actually get the little damage, or little damage bonus, I guess, from Bleed Me Dry, which sucks, but we also have now the Polaroid Forever Active which can be very, very good in the... Uh, oh, there's an eternal heart. I don't really want it. It could be very, very good in the witness fight, just because you saw last Isaac episode, uh, we drained a lot of health on the witness fight really quickly. So yeah, I mean, tinted rocks are gonna be very important. A small rock, okay. I was asking for it all game. Comes a little late, but better late than never. I had a feeling we were gonna get hit there. I'm not exactly sure where I could have went to dodge that. Damn. Oh, that's huge. Please, soul hearts this time, please. At least one, thank you. Got him. Got him. Sorry, guys. Concentration level just kind of goes up a little bit when you get to the corpse. Because all the health that you drain in the corpse, man, is the health that you lose that you don't have for the witness fight. We're about to be a witness to the litness, so we got to hold on to each and every one of our soul hearts. I can't do the curse room. Not right now, anyway. Who knows? Maybe our fortunes will change, but right now... It's not worth it. Curse of the Maze really didn't want me to go down here. Okay. Penetrative and big tears against these guys is so good. As you can see. You kind of just wipe out all waves of them with your uh, streamline of buzzsaw tears. So not so bad. That's That was intense. Jesus. Just turrets, rot, and heart. Too bad we can't pick it up. We don't have any red hearts. Rotten heart would have been nice. I mean, there's probably a tinted rock in there that we should go back for. Saw it come in the last second. Couldn't get out of the way. Uh, all right, there's gotta be Tin Rock either here or on the one before this. No dice so far. No dice on this room. Let's see in this other big room. Uh, no, 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 no. Really? Okay. All right, batting the zero on Tinted Rocks there. That's interesting. Okay, I'll take that. That's very nice of you. Spawning enemy spiders, piece of garbage. I don't really know what this does. Is this like a holy heart? I think this is the holy heart, if I remember correctly. A heart's a heart, though. A heart's a freaking heart. No more tinted rocks. 
Come on, soul heart, you piece of garbage. Hey, four, four items here. Come on. Well, that's a damage up. Spectral tears for like the third time. That's another damage up, which is awesome. Uh, bum friend, you know, whatever. All right. Well, here goes nothing, I guess. Here goes nothing. I mean, I'm going to do the temporary tears up, even though I don't think it does anything. Oh, I forgot you got to move out of the way from that. No, not like this. Not like this. I'm caught in the tears again. Okay, he's on the second phase. Come on, rotten baby. Help a boy out. Help a boy out. Get those flies in there, bud. Oh, that dot. <laughs> no, it's so hard. I'm tilt. I'm tilt. I'm full tilt. We did it. We did it. We did it. Revenge is ours. The witness is dead, boys. Eat and run. W feels good, man. I'll let this play for anybody who hasn't seen it. Steep, dude. That's so loud. Why is how is it so loud? All right, man. Well, that's a W. I mean, we got a win streak of one on the witness. Who knows? Maybe we'll do some more anti-birth. Like I said, if you really want to see more anti-birth, make sure you leave this a like. That lets me know that you want to see more of anti-birth. Uh, we'll still be sprinkling in afterbirth, sprinkling in anti-birth. You know, you know the drill. All right, we're not going completely away from modded afterbirth plus. Um, but I'm feeling a little bit of uh, the anti-birth itch and i'm just here to scratch it hope you guys enjoyed it also check out these two videos listed down below if you haven't seen them already make sure you subscribe for more daily isaac content thank you guys so much for watching until next time stay safe stay up peace out